explain the peri procedure regimen because it looks like you're doing these all on an outpatient, sometimes in yeah. clinic basis, right? So yeah, all, next, all in clinic. Okay. So give a thumbnail sketch on what the average venous procedure would involve. So to get an idea about that, you just need to go back to the initial consultation. So initially they come in, they have their consult where we chat about the veins. We do the, a detailed vein map, which gives me an idea of how we you know, proceed. Basically, and you're, and that you're doing that map, with ultrasound? Yes. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Ultrasound is the gold standard right. for venous mapping. Sometimes in large patients, you may want to do a CT venogram, but the vast majority of it can be dealt with with ultrasound. So so once you've got the ultrasound, the two things that you're really looking for is, is there truncal insufficiency and where the where the varicosities re-enter into? So there will be a inflow site, which is often your truncal vein, and an outflow site, which is often your perforator vein. So once you've found out where the inflow and outflow is, then you can go and then deal with this patient. 